National documents like IDs and birth certificates are essential when dealing with public and private institutions. But victims of house fires, as well as homeless people, often find themselves without documents. This puts them at a disadvantage, making it difficult for them to receive government assistance like social grants. It's against this background that the Ministry of Home Affairs, Safety and Security is providing some local residents with national documents. The 193 documents are for the homeless people currently accommodated at stadiums as well as Ventuk's recent fire victims. Normally when you lost uh, your ID, when you get to Home Affairs to get your duplicate, uh, there is a payment that is involved. But this one, we are, we are doing it uh, uh, free of charge uh, because it goes to a specific group that has become vulnerable because of disaster or, in a way, those who have become disadvantaged. At the same event, the governor of the Comas region, Laura McLeod Kashira, asked residents for donations that would assist in the fight against COVID-19. Fellow Comas residents, on a positive note, let me at this juncture extend our humble request for donation of soaps, masks, sanitizers and gloves to all social partners and strategic stakeholders in the region in order for us to address this extremely need on the ground appropriately. The governor also expressed her gratitude to everyone in the Comas region who donated to the misplaced fire victims of the then Loka in the Erongo region. The governor was giving an update on the regional response strategies which takes place once a week. Francis Shahama, NBC News, Ventuk.